Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to extend your C drive on your PC, when it's full. This is a common problem that many of us face, and it can be frustrating when you can't save or install anything on your computer. But don't worry, in this video, I'll guide you through the steps to extend your C drive, and get your computer running smoothly again. Without any further ado, let's start the video. The first thing you need to do is check if the C drive on your computer is really full. To do this, open File Explorer from the Start menu. You can see the available space in the C drive. As you can see on my screen, my C drive is almost full, and it's indicated in red color, which means it's at a dangerous level. However, we need to increase the space on my C drive, in order to make my computer run smoothly. To extend your C drive, you need to have free space available on your computer. As you can see, my D drive is completely empty, and I want to add it to my C drive. However, it's important to note that you can only add a drive directly to the C partition if the partition next to it is empty. This means that users cannot add drives such as E, F, and others directly to the C drive, but only if the adjacent partition is empty. To proceed further, open Disk Management. To do that, right click on the This PC icon and select the Manage option. The computer management window will appear. Navigate to the storage option from the left menu on the window. Then, select Disk Management. Once you click on Disk Management, the hard disk partitions will appear. As you can see on my screen, I have a single hard disk installed with multiple partitions. Let me delete the D partition. To do that, right click on the partition and select Delete Volume. Once you click on Delete Volume, an auto-generated alert will appear, stating that deleting this volume will erase all data on it. Back up any data you want to keep before deleting. Do you want to continue? Click on Yes to proceed. Once you click on Yes, another message will appear, stating that the partition D simple volume is currently in use. To force the deletion of this partition, click Yes. Once you click on Yes, the volume will be deleted and you will see that the unallocated space is now available. This unallocated space can be allocated to the C drive to extend the existing space. To extend, right-click on the C drive, and then click on Extend Volume. Once you click on Extend Volume, the Extend Volume wizard will appear. To continue, click on Next. Here, you can specify the size and MBs to extend the C drive from the unallocated space. Then click on Next to close and finish the task. Click on Finish to complete the process. As you can see on my screen, the C drive space will be extended. To check the C drive's latest space after the extension, go back to the My Computer tab and refresh it. The updated space will appear. I hope you now understand how to extend the C drive without formatting it on a single installed hard disk. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. 